and welcome to the Institute of Contemporary Art Boston. My name is Gabrielle and I'm the Associate Director of Education here at the ICA. Today I'm going to give you some tips on how to make the most of your visit. The ICA is located in the Waterfronts Innovation District, close to South Station, and is accessible via the T's Silver and Red Line. If you're watching this video, you're probably planning on bringing a group to the ICA or you're thinking about it. Please keep in mind that we do offer free passes to teachers and group leaders who have scheduled a group visit to the museum. When you come to the ICA, remember to arrive a few minutes early to allow time to check in at the admissions desk, allow your students to use the restroom, and check their belongings like coats, backpacks, food, and drink. Their belongings will be safely stowed in the coat check area until the end of their visit. If for any reason you're running late, please remember to call the admissions desk at the number below. Upon check-in, the staff in admissions will provide you with signifiers for you and any other chaperones or leaders to wear while visiting the galleries. Chaperones play an active role during the visit, making sure students stay together and enjoy their time at the ICA. If you have registered for a guided tour, your guide will greet your group right here in the lobby. If you have registered for an art lab, this is the space where you'll be during the hands-on portion of your visit. Even if you choose to visit as a self-guided group, we ask all large groups to divide into smaller ones, 10 to 12 students per adult chaperone. Arranging these smaller groups before you arrive will be helpful to you. We have art in the fourth floor galleries, and here we have the art wall. All of the art at the ICA is meant to be enjoyed and also respected. You can access the galleries by the elevator or stairs. Now let's go upstairs. Our tours are about contemporary art and ideas, and we encourage dialogue and interaction between students and their guide. If you're here for a self-guided visit, consider using one of the many resources that are available to your group, like using your cell phone to listen to one of our audio tours, or talking to one of our visitor assistants about the work on view, or checking out the media tech, which is filled with great resources for you and your students, including books, touch screens with videos and information on them, as well as an amazing view of the harbor. If you've prepared any writing or sketching activities for your students to do, please remember to bring a number two pencil. There are no pens or markers permitted on the fourth floor. Your students are welcome to sit on the floor in front of artworks, as long as they maintain a safe distance away from the works of art. Additionally, please make sure they're leaving a clear path for other visitors to walk through the gallery space. If there are ever any questions, please feel free to ask one of our visitor assistants. In order to keep the artwork safe, please remember to maintain a distance of at least one foot between yourself and the artwork. Also, when you're talking about works of art, please remember not to gesture too closely because that can damage the work as well. We also ask that you respect all stanchions, taped lines, and platforms. Also, please remember not to touch the art. Assume that you cannot touch an exhibit unless otherwise noted. If you have questions, don't hesitate to ask one of our visitor assistants. A good place to sit down and do some writing or take a break from the art is this gallery. It has restrooms and water fountains too, but please remember that food and drinks are not allowed anywhere on the fourth floor. Groups wishing to purchase lunch in the Wolfgang Puck Water Cafe must make arrangements with the cafe in advance. You can do so by contacting the number on the screen. Your group may opt to bring their lunches and eat them outdoors on the ICA's grandstand, weather permitting. That's it. Thank you for your interest in the ICA, and we look forward to welcoming you to the museum.